All right, what's next? Lee DeWald writes, I was watching a behind the scenes video of a recent episode of The Walking Dead where a talking head was mentioning that a stunt they filmed for said episode would normally take a movie one week to shoot and The Walking Dead crew was able to complete it in one day. This got me to thinking about a rant John Campia had a month or so ago complaining about how the budgets of movies are ballooning to obscene costs. First question, wouldn't it behoove film students to adopt the television style of shooting scenes at a quicker pace? I would think this would lower costs, maybe not by much, but at least it's something. Second question, why does it take a movie a week to film a stunt when a television show can do it in a day? I know television is in a time crunch to get episodes filmed every seven to ten days, but there has to be more to it than just that. Thanks everyone at Collider and keep up the outstanding work. Well, the question, uh, the answer to your question is quality. I mean, that's the thing. I'm actually not a person. I don't like for me. I love movies. I love television. I, they both have advantages and disadvantages to each of them. So I'm not a person that's like, oh, yeah, movies are better. Or television's better. I, I like them equally. However, one of the main advantages that movies have is time and money. And when you want to do an action sequence, especially because you're asking people to leave their home and pay money and sit in a theater. There's there's a lot to go see a movie. In order to do that, you have to deliver on something they can't see at home. And what can't they see at home is these kind of spectacle scenes, like a lot of visual effects and, and having these action sequences done well. And in order to do them well, you've got to take your time. Where in television, they are on a schedule. They've got to pump these things out. So you'll see a lot of subpar. I'm not saying all movies have better action television but it's general it's a general rule that they spend much more time and they just have more quality there what do you guys think and let's not forget the team that the talking head in question is on they're definitely talking about how great the walking dead is and how quickly they are at making stunts happen but you should if you're going to skimp something on movie sets there's thousands of places where you can cut costs and you don't have to worry about the safety of the stunt players because that should be paramount on any movie set they should get all the time in the world to set up the stunt properly to execute it as many times they see fit if you need to cut costs on a movie set serve flank steak instead of filet and also understand that they are six seasons into the show so they have a, a working relationship they know their teams they know what they're able to do what they're capable of doing with these movies you know it's anywhere it takes six months to a year to film these things and sometimes it's a brand new crew sometimes it's 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 new people coming in but i think that it really hits on the points that you made dennis is that it's it's more time it's more money there's more involvement there's more risk Sometimes a lot in, with with the movies, um, not that there's not risk in television, but whereas if you're going to have a bad episode in TV, it's like, okay, well, let's let's work on the next one. Let's see what, what do we do wrong there. Let's let's make sure that we can figure this out as where it's one shot film that scene. It's gone. You're not you're not going to have another shot to do it unless you get the sequel down the line. You want to make some more improvements. So I think that you're right. I think it's more about the time and it's the money. And you can tell the, TV, the difference between TV. And even you look at something like Game of Thrones. Mm -hmm which when you go back to season two with the Battle of Blackwater, very rare that you get television that looks like that. That was a film quality, and that was a very expensive scene. They had to put a lot of money into the scene. They had to cut a lot of stuff in order to put the money into that scene. So it, it's really about budget, and, the, and when you see certain shows that have smaller budget, you can tell. Yeah, and speaking of Game of Thrones, they did that also with that one uh, episode that was at the wall, where it was like the big fight with the giants and the oh, right, the, right. the people from uh, beyond the wall, uh, the wildlings. But out of ten episodes, they can only afford to do that once. Right. And, and even you know, by TV standards, Game of Thrones is kind of more of the exception than the rule because they got a lot more money, a lot more. They give them more time. Where right. if you're talking about network TV, where you're doing twenty episodes a season. They don't have and time And we're not even talking that. about network TV. We're talking about AMC, who probably doesn't right. have nearly the production budget that HBO does, much less something of a major motion picture. Well, they, Game of Thrones is looked at within the nine or ten episodes they do per season as very cinematic. Yeah. And where I think that, and Walking Dead is what, 22 episodes? 16. 16, 16 episodes, yeah. but still, it's, it's significantly more. That's why Walking Dead, sometimes they just have those episodes where nothing no, happens. Nothing happens. Yeah. Because they Literally just, nothing happens. Yeah, it's like the they, they, they probably try to stunt, and they're like, uh, the stunt didn't work. Sorry, right. here's Morgan hanging out wearing an Aikido. Yeah, and if you notice, Game of Thrones, <laughs> Every year, this premiere gets pushed back a week, two mm -hmm. weeks. This this year, it's I think the end of April now. And it's because Game of Thrones, yeah, because they want to take the time for to 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 make things better. Right. They still do a great job on on, on Walking Dead. Oh yeah, it's just, for sure. It's just that maybe maybe if you're going to cover yourself in zombie guts, maybe do the head too, just to be safe. Or do it every day. <laughs> if it works, do it every day. 
Hey guys, if you like this clip, click here to watch the entire episode. Also, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel because it'll help you stay up to date with all the stuff we've got going on here at Collider.